Welcome back to the KCRA 3 experience. Halloween isn't this weekend, but we thought we'd kind of kick things off a little bit early and get into the spirit. We have a professional makeup artist, actually artists, with us here today. We're going to turn some lovely ladies into monsters. Has that ever happened before? Well, we won't get into that, but this is Pam Knight with the Federico Beauty Institute and her models today. Pam, you wanted to start off with the most uh, difficult one or the scariest one, so uh, why don't we lead off here with Jennifer? Okay, Jennifer, today we have turned into a witch, rather kind of gory, showing that we've got this prosthetic. Within the neck prosthetic, you would have to go in with some Vaseline to bring this alive to make it nice and gory looking. Oh, so it really looks like a So uh, it'll look like wound. a real wound. Yeah. You know. Yeah, but that does do it, too. But within the prosthetics, you have to start with a clean surface. Okay and then you use the prosthetic glue. Mm -hmm. After that, we do a nice stippling effect with latex, so everybody okay. has to make sure that they're not allergic to latex right. to blend it out before we can ever begin to start putting the colors and creating the actual width. Okay, Jennifer, do you feel warm in that? No, not at all. So she's pretty comfortable with all that stuff, and it comes off pretty quickly? Yes, you could use some Vaseline. Okay. The Vaseline's an oil base. It helps work the glue up. How quickly could you take that chin off? Does that just come that right chin off? off? No, it's, it's going to take about a minute or oh, two well, with okay. some Vaseline. I was going to say, if you could rip it off, it would be good TV. <laughs> okay, let's go on to the uh, flapper, Gabriella. Gabriella is showing our glamour mm -hmm. as far as our student artist, makeup artist. If you can see, she has very nice makeup in her eyes, a lot of glitter to bring them out, and her hair as well. We go into the finger waves to bring out that nice flapper look at that point in time. A lot of flappers for Halloween, and it seems like, I mean, it's a pretty basic look. Well, I mean, you can clearly see that this is Gabriella with our other two models. We don't really know who they are. Right, that's true. Some people do like that because they're going to work. Okay, sure. And um, it still looks pretty professional, but mm -hmm. they can still join in in the Halloween. Okay excitement yeah it's pretty professional I, I would say so now we've got um, Nicole over here and she's the cat and that's a pretty good uh, nose thing that you've got going on there yes the nose on her is another prosthetic that we've done mm -hmm. but with her we have taken a picture so the students have learned to look at a picture okay. and actually duplicate that onto the model with the lights and darks as you can see through the nose you have to have a dark to bring the nose out to make it look bigger mm -hmm. and then the white makes it just gives you that nice little punch in there so she looks more like a cat now how long would it take to get nicole to be made up like that with the makeup in the face about an hour and a half so it's almost like how they do it in movies i mean you hear about the uh, actors having to be in the chair for four hours right and what's fabulous about this is it's a great deal they can either buy their prosthetics from federico's or they can go to a specialty store and come in. It's $20 for the first hour and $10 for every half an hour after that. Approximately, it takes them an hour and a half. So for folks who really want to do it upright for a Halloween party, they can come into Federico's and say, I want the number 17 exactly. or whatever it is, mm -hmm. and you'll do them upright. You bet we will. And they've all been trained with it. We also specialize in children as well. Oh, that's great. Children, we know that we don't like their vision or okay. their peripheral vision mm -hmm. abstracted when they're out. They need to be in nice, comfortable shoes. But they're $10 for the first hour okay. and $5 for every half an hour after that. All right. So if they want to come in, they can. Pam, thank you. Ladies, you're thank welcome. you for joining us today. I know you're anxious to get out of the, uh, the makeup and get on with your weekend at hand. Thank you all. Well, the weekend is just about here. And